Oder fasziniert auf die Kühe. Die Kühe sind cool. Mu! Mu! Hallo. Ich habe den Fehl getroffen, der Chain noch gehalten hat. Ja, Mann. Alles, was gibt es? Ah ja, noch gerne da. Ein Pose hat. Ich lasse ihn Aktivieren wäre sicher noch geil. Because, oh mein Gott! <lacht> so, that's my new S13. Stood for about 8 years. Looks pretty fucking nice. Emptied out. A wacky ass bucket seat. And now on to the trailer. We'll be good, we'll be good. We've got some parts over here. Pretty legit, if you ask me. For a good price, a good deal, and ready for the build. This is gonna be good. Nice. What a good. Das ist nicht scheiße. Hoppa. Ich kann schon ein Slow Motion sehen. Hoppa. What is up guys, um, at first I welcome you to my YouTube channel, hope you gonna enjoy it or my content. I thought I'd make this for some cool videos about the Swiss cars, Swiss car scene. Um, also I'm filming some stuff for the Drift Bastards. And I'm gonna show off some of my stuff, my cars, my builds, builds, if you wanna call them like that. Um, my new shop, of course. We're gonna do some stuff like build a room, build some workbenches, put up a lift. Um, yeah. Last week, last week, last weekend, I got a new car, a new S13, Swiss spec, sunroof, CA, 18 powered, four lug, um, almost stock. Got a big turbo, stage one upgrades, nothing special, no, almost no rust, that's cool. Yeah. The goal with that S13, which is right next to me, is to get it on the street, street legal, to enjoy it, to drive it around. And my other one, which is behind the camera, is gonna stay for a while until I finish the new one and get it street legal so I can focus on my pink one which some of you may know from my Instagram or Facebook or something yeah that's about that 
So that's the beauty, the S13, pretty stock, like got some lowering springs, nothing special, nothing fancy. Gotta grab a light because it's kind of dark. And, oh yeah, I forgot, we got this one. Just so, as you can see, we got a CA18, as some of you guys may recognize. Kind of stock looking, but got stage one. We got a front mount intercooler, a big one. We got a HKS turbo, which you can't see. Hold up. So, we got a HKS GTSS turbo, got a Z32 math. We got some other stuff in here going on, like some gauges and wiring and few fucked up things which we need to address, we need to clean up. Yeah, the engine bay is kind of dirty as you can see. So we gotta sort that out, clean it up. I tried it to clean over here. Looks good, better than before. Guess a good cleaning job will do the trick and the engine bay will look kind of good again, I hope. We're gonna see. Took away the front end, the front bumper, it's laying over here because I sold it. Uh, we got two pig noses and I think one is enough. I'm gonna do some other stuff to this one to look a little bit better. I'll keep my other S, uh, pig nose front and just for the sake maybe I'll put it on again, maybe not, I don't know. We'll see. So, to the interior, short, it's empty. It's fucked up, we need to address that, get some sound deadening back in because it will be a daily driver and I kind of want it with some comfort. We need some stock seats again, I got those, lucky me. So let me open this one up. So, no door card, it's laying over there. I just need to install it again but I think that will have to wait some time. Sadly no carpet. Need to address that. Need to sell the bucket seat because I can't fit in it. Got some gauges going on in here. Sadly no stuff down here. Need to search for this. We got a stage one chip installed. The speedo says 300,000, 320,000 kilometers. I don't know what that in miles is, but enough, I guess. So, that's about that. My S13, I'm gonna show you guys in another video. Hopefully, maybe we can drive it around or something. I don't know. Yeah, we got a bunch of parts for the air chassis over here. And let's do some stuff. I think I'll film the progress as we go on because the engine bay needs a cleanup. It needs some maintenance, some stuff to change. Will be good when it's done, hopefully.
so I started tearing apart the engine, the CA18 out of the new S13 to get a better look, to see how the oil is, how the bearings look if they're good, if they're trash, I, I have no idea the car is set for 8 years, so who knows sadly I didn't film the process taking it out, but hey, it is what it is so, first looks see here, we got the turbo I have no idea, I think this is a 28 this ball bearing spinny tank, but this thing looks pretty trashed we need to sort this out now this is one problem we got that Chinese custom manifold I have no idea what the fuck this is um, maybe we'll reuse it maybe I'll swap out to a stock exhaust manifold I don't know yet we got the intake which I'm gonna clean up maybe clean it a little bit off like lines I don't need because the car will be a summer driver then we got the clutch looks okay I'll swap it out for another one but it looked okay I mean the car was drifted the car was trashed so that's a good sign the oil we got the oil over here looks good yeah, it's black but no metal shavings no nothing so that's positive positive. and now to the engine so this is a CA18 as you guys recognize I uh, showed you before took the oil pan off now the next step would be to see how the bearings look as we took out the engine I looked in the engine bay to see how that looks like um, rust and things but it's all pretty dirty but pretty clean so that's that's good less work for me so the car will be sooner on the street again hopefully so a quick look I'll trash this one out the battery holder because I don't need that I'm gonna relocate the battery anyway but other than that there may be rust down here Oops. so you guys can see it better I'm gonna sort this out this here beneath here like the common spaces where it rusts on this side too I'll take away this piece and see how it looks below and other than that the frames look pretty good like as I, as I mentioned it's pretty dirty I need to clean that up but I guess that's it if you guys have questions just feel free ask me I'm gonna try and answer them yes let's wrap it up peace